you welcome back we're back in timmerborn and we have uh skipped ahead a whole cycle just to see if we can get some extra supplies in here i'm going to start up our sequoia feller because it looks like we've got three ready to come down we've got some extra dynamite that we need to take care of today and we can get that out of here there we go. We'll have to set up another one for this. But what we really want to focus on today is we're once again low on beavers. And we keep trying to get rid of more and more uh, places that need beavers to work. But so far, we are just way ahead of where we need to be. So... We're going to, once again, put in a couple more places. But we're going to start with this dynamite so that we can go ahead and get it out of the way. Let's cut out this here. There we go. We want to say that's high priority while we're here. There we go. They'll get rid of that. Let's put in dynamite all along the edge here. Two, three, four... Five, six, seven, eight, nine. We'll do dynamite here. We'll say that's a little more important. And then we'll work our way around the edge so that we can get all of that down. Something else that may help us is a little bit more well being. And I think we're going to start here on this tower with that. We're going to grab. Some side platforms here. Here we go. We want to put one here. We want to put one here. Now we can't put one in the middle here, but what we can do is grab a regular platform and use that here. Do I want to put those up one? Uh, you know what? I kind of do. Let's move these up. In fact, we'll just use three of these. There we go. And what I want to put in is some more roofs, just so it looks nice. There we go. Uh, nope, not there. And in the middle here, we will toss in a scarecrow for the scarecrow buff. There we go. We'll do the same thing over here. Grab our, where is it? There it is, platforms. And put those at the same level, not the platforms that I wanted. We want these platforms. There we go. There we go. Another scarecrow. Excellent. So they can build those in. Now, the next big thing that I'd like to build in is just a little bit higher up than that. However, we're going to need... A little bit more space for it. We're going to need something like this. Now, we can't quite build those from here. But what we'll have to do is let's see if we can go from here. And uh, I don't know if they'll be able to build over that. You know what? We'll just build the one. And if they can't, we'll come back with whatever else they might need. We'll just work out how to do it. But we're going to put these in here, definitely. So we'll let them work on that. And then up here on top, we can put in some more houses to help with the population problem. We'll temporarily lose connection to these two up here, but that's not a huge deal. Let's do this. And then... We want to put one in this way. We could do another overpass, but uh, I'm not feeling the overpass. Let's. Oh, actually, I got to face it this way so they can still get into those storage units there, I guess you can call them. There we go. So that was an easy decision. And let's make sure that's. Facing the right way. There you go. We'll let them work on that. Might take them just a couple of minutes. We'll get... Path put back in there. Just so they can do that. There we go. 
Okay. That looks good. And that'll get us a couple more beavers as well. Our line of dynamite's in up here. So let's go ahead and get rid of that. There we go. Actually, we need another line along here as well. So let's go ahead and get this in there. We'll do this. And these are growing back again. I thought we had got rid of them, but I guess not. Those brambles, no matter what, cause problems. So let's say, go ahead, get rid of those. That should take care of that. We'll go ahead and toss a couple of extra dynamite in here as well. There we go. And we're just going to say all of this can be blown up. We'll let them plant that dynamite. Let's go ahead and get the ones here. There we go. Grab some of these and let them work on that for a minute. Over here on our great tower of squeezing, we've got a couple more places ready to go in. So we'll go ahead, toss in yet another couple of screw presses and hope that we can get some more of the sunflower oil because it is still used in just absolutely everything. While we're here, we might as well say, hey, let's put in some more because we know we're going to need some more. We might as well get started on them. And we'll put in the road to connect everything in here. There we go. And we're going to do one there, one there, one here, one here. And we'll let them work on that next layer. Change my mind over here. We're going to just use the doubles so that we can get this out of the way. We should have a little bit of extra nitro going around. It's not the most efficient way to do things. But we will do them this way anyway, just so we can get this done a little bit quicker. We shouldn't be using a lot of the nitro because our dynamite is staying fairly full at the moment not completely full but full enough that we can definitely spare some for these two deep charges and that's our bramble field over here gains in size we're definitely going to need a couple more of these harvester offices so i'm gonna go ahead build up the ladders that we need and once those are in we'll start putting a couple more offices on top of these the original plan over here was to use up some extra beavers to pull in these trees. However, now I need the extra beavers. So we're going to go ahead and change these out for the better ones. I'm going to pause these. We'll see if they'll come over and empty those real quick. There we go. And then while they do that, let's find our basic structures. We're going to need a wood felling plantation plant. Actually, we need to remove these two behind, don't we? There we go. Uh, are those done already? Yep, they came and got those pretty quick. We're going to set these up high so they'll get rid of them. And then we'll probably send this guy somewhere else. So that we have just more beavers to handle things. There they go. They're working on that just a little bit. Got all of that in there. Let's get in our wood filling plantification lodge right there next door. We'll say that's kind of important and we'll get some people in here. And once that's done, we'll take that out and plant another tree there. We finally started to get a couple of extra beavers, so I'm going to turn this on right away. And we're going to start on some robotic controller blueprints. It's going to take a bit, but I believe we can copy these out once they're done if that still works the same way as it used to let's double check yep we can copy those out so we'll do that once that's made and we can start looking into the more automatic farms well it looks like they can't quite get out there so let's see what we can do on the platform side can we do corner from this thing no uh, let's do, if I do this, there we go. 
we'll see if they can build in these two. If they can't, we'll uh, put another platform set out here. They did get these in, though, so that should be bringing us a little bit of extra well-being. And it looks pretty nice, I think. I think I'm going to do something I haven't done in a while and open a new trade route. So let's take a look and see what we have to trade. Um, I'm not sure that's got anything on it that I would want. The brain boosting for 50 dynamite's not bad, but let's see what else we've got. Uh, the amp ears, uh, six, six scaffoldings for 30. That's not great. And that only happens every three days. Let's see. Got some bramble flowers. Eh, not bad. Not great. Let's see. Uh, well, this isn't bad. We could trade some toys for bananas or tea for rice or get some seashells. Let's start with the island beavers. I think that will do us pretty well. We're going to have to build a base first, though, aren't we? Let's start with base, and it will face this way. Just the same as all the others. We'll get it connected in here. There we go. In fact, can I go through here, or is there... Nope, nothing blocking me there. And then we will put the island beavers up here. There we go. And we'll let them work on that. And we'll set it to... Let's start with some... Oh, they have coconuts too. Nice. Uh, let's start with rice. And we'll just work with that. Slight miscalculation here. I put the houses up before I put these up. So we're going to have to move those up one more layer. Let's put in... Platforms. We'll grab this. This and this. Take you, put you here. And move you over to here. And we'll see if that will do it for us. So we can get these other platforms in. We're getting to get some extra beavers here, which is good. So I think it's time we do yet another uh, hauling tower. Hopefully things will work better. I want to put it here, closer to uh, our water over here, and maybe they can help focus that just a bit. Let me make sure. Uh, do I want to move it over? Probably. So let's actually take that out of there. We will put in dynamite. Let's remove these. And we'll remove this and this. Say those are all very high priority so they can get in there. And we'll come back and put another one in here eventually. They've got a lot of this dynamite in over here. So we're going to go ahead, remove some of this. There we go. And we'll remove some of this up here as well. That looks good. We'll mark this to get rid of. Yep. And eventually we're going to have to make our way around and get rid of some of this here too. But we don't need to do that quite yet. So let's just put in the dynamite here. And then we're going to take this and expand this field out quite a bit. So we shouldn't ever have problems with brambles after this. Hopefully. Let's put that there too. There we go. So now we've got a decent amount of the sequoias. We've got our brambles in here, and we've got a little bit left to clear out. There we go. They've got the last of the dynamite. That's all in. Let's do another one of these good old hauling towers. And we'll make sure it's facing the right way. Looks like it is. Yeah. And then... Uh, do we need... No, they have other paths to get there. So, we'll go ahead and take this out of here. Put in a ladder. Or two. Or three. Get a platform. One platform so they can build the other. And then a one bridge there. Right in. Make sure the path connects. 
And there they go. They can work on that. We'll get a new hauling tower. Been noticing our food is slowly going down. In fact, we're not having much in the way of food variety. So I think we're going to convert, at least temporarily, a couple more places over here to farms. We have been growing our population quite a bit. So probably just not getting the help that it needs. I want to put one in here. Let's see. Let's put one right about here. We'll have to get a bridge out there somehow. We got a four. Yeah, that's it. We'll put you in here, connect you up. And then I'd like a farm. We're actually going to need a farmhouse here. We're going to do two farmhouses. We're going to do the assistant farmers there. And then we are actually just going to plant this full. Here we go. Of cabbages. So all the cabbages. All the cabbages all the time. There we go. Those in there. Don't know if it'll be able to reach all of these, but we'll put them down here too. And we'll say that's pretty high priority there. Let's get those in. And then I'd like to also get some fertilization irrigation going up here. So let's take a look. Do I want the larger ones up here? Could probably do a couple. What about the smaller ones? That might actually be a little bit easier. Let's move this over just a bit. We'll put one here. We'll put one here to temporarily fill in those spots. And then as for farmhouses, let's see if we can get some more food in here from them. We'll do two right in the middle. We won't do the additional one on there for now. Uh, if we need one to pull one in, we'll do that. But let's see, we need, well, just about everything, really. So, let's say... Um, we'll do this with cabbages as well. Just because we need those extra cabbages to make everything, keep everything going. So we'll do all of that in cabbage. We'll do all of this in cabbage. We'll see how far out it reaches. We'll also say that those are slightly more important too. Noticing we're going down on mushrooms, even though we've got them running really well. So let's take care of these. We'll put in maybe three more here. There we go. We'll just come down this way. And we'll get those in. Again, we'll make that... Just a little bit more important. And let's take a look at how our sawdust is going, because it doesn't seem to be making it over here for some reason. This might be part of it here. We need sawdust to be made. Right now, it's making a whole lot of the chestnut flour, which we do need, but we're full on it. So we're going to switch that to sawdust, and we are going to tell them that these are important. That's important. And then I believe these over here. Oh, uh, where'd that go? This. Yep. And this. So all of these mushrooms can be set to the fastest. Here we go. Fastest. Fastest. And hopefully that'll get some mushrooms made for us as well. We're starting to build up some extra dirt as well. So let's go ahead and get a place use all that. I want to make these four wide starting now and we'll probably go back and replace these because the newer versions of this uh, actually are one longer so we'll have to upgrade that eventually. Some of the dynamite is back in over here so we're just going to go ahead and blow that up. There we go. We've got one that will need to go in here. There we go go one there and then we're going to start taking down some of this so 
we need to first remove the road here. There we go. All of that can go. We won't really need these eventually. We're going to put in the... Let's just do the single dynamite since we have plenty of those. And can I come around here from this side? Uh, let's just do this. We'll connect those in. Run a road this way. They should be able to get a lot of those in there. We'll just do this whole row right here all at once. Well, our first robotic controller blueprint is done. So that means I can pause. We don't need much of the other stuff at the present moment. We should have them set up. Yep, they should start copying out. and We'll keep an eye on those. We'll get some of those made, which we definitely need. Now we just need to see if we can get in here and actually get some farming done to get our food going back up. It's still going down, unfortunately. There we go. There's our first layer out of here. So let's get that done. There we go. Some of the hydration actually went through there. Good, good. Well, we'll take out another level and hopefully there's even more that gets removed. We're going to have to go about that far. And we will put a path here. There we go. Say those are a little more important. Nope. There we go. Hopefully, at least when we remove this one, then the uh, irrigation will cover most of this area. We'll see. Even if there's not uh, like a, a square or two here, we should still be all right. They got our next hauling tower in. It's almost full, uh, but we've definitely taken a hit on the population there. That's okay. The haulers should help out quite a bit. Let's see if we can tell it, hold the lotus, because that's really holding two things in one. So hopefully they can get stuff moved around from the middle of the map. Maybe that'll make it easier for them to get uh, all this water that they've been picking up out of there. On the food side over here, it looks like the, the cabbages are coming in, so we're getting some of those. Hopefully we'll get some more for here and keep the the food up for just a bit. Our... Oops, let's uh, set these guys up so they know they need to be in there. We could put them for the slower ones, but I would prefer to keep the mushrooms in stock and going. So we're just going to do that. They can take care of themselves. We still didn't get any sawdust over here, so... Maybe with the extra haulers, eventually some of this stuff will get filled up so they don't have to go as far. But I think that's going to do it for today. We are uh, kind of in a slow descent, but hopefully we can pull out of it. But I just want to say, as always, thank you very much for stopping by. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe, and I hope to see you next time. Bye!